Hey Fox, what's up? Hey, what's up, man? What you off? What you watching? Oh, you know, just uh. Anyway, did you find out where you're going to college at next year? Well, Delaware State offered me the best scholarship, so my parents want me to go there. Oh, but what about that music school that you were into? Fox, that was just an idea. My parents want me to be a doctor, so I have to go somewhere I can study pre-med. But you're so lucky, you have everything planned out. You know, you, Melanie, NYU. I'll see you later. See ya. Good morning, Fox. Hey, Mel. Did you accept your offer to NYU yet? I know you always put things off until the last minute, but it is due tomorrow. Yeah, well, I actually wanted to talk to you about that. Oh, I know. I wanted to talk to you about it, too. See, I think we can really make it work. I know that Juilliard and NYU are within walking distance of each other, but... Mel, stop. I just don't I'm... want the fact that we're going to separate colleges to get in the way of our relationship. No, I'm not sure about all this. But Fox, that's always been the plan. I go to Juilliard to study dance, you go to NYU for liberal arts, I do a career in dancing, and you become a teacher just like your parents were, what? we start a family. When did I tell you I wanted to be a teacher? Well, never. But you never told me what job you wanted, so I just assumed you would follow in your parents' footsteps. There is no way in hell that I would ever be a teacher. I would rather shovel cow manure with my bare hands for the rest of my life than become a teacher. All right, students, if you have a conversation about cow poop or breaking up with someone, it needs to go out in the hallway. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Okay guys, great job. I will see you next week. Hey Fox. I know you were looking forward to being in this number for the showcase, but I'm gonna have to cut you. What? I'm sorry. But I've been practicing for weeks. Well, now you know how it feels for things to go not according to plan. Is this all about me not going to NYU? That and the fact that you're a terrible dancer. I guess that I've just kind of decided that I don't want to go to college. Oh, son, I know, I know that you want to spread your eagle wings and soar into the, into the happy little cloud. I know that you think that the man and society are trying to chain your creativity, just like they chained Shamu! <laughs> you just need to understand that college will set you free. And at NYU you can develop your artistic spirit, like we developed our artistic spirit. But that doesn't even count. You went to art school. You might as well have just flushed all your tuition money down the toilet. Thoughts, wild spirit, Jones. You show your parents some respect. 
Well, it's just that what I want to do doesn't require me going to college to get a degree. Oh, Fox, you can still study dance at college. But I don't want to study dance. Art? No. Drama? No. Music? I want to sell insurance. <laughs> say that you want to sell your soul to corporate business? No, I didn't say that. I said I want to sell insurance. I want to be a salesman and I want to help people. I know that I would be a perfect fit and I know that I have a passion for this. A passion? Fox, do you really think that selling insurance will fulfill your spirit? Yes, I'm serious. Is this why we got that issue of insurance monthly that one time? Yes, and then you proceeded to yell that salesmen are the spawns of Satan and proceeded to burn the magazine right in front of me. This is why I never wanted to tell you all this until now. Fox, your mother and I did not make sacrifices for you so that you could help people save 50% or more on car insurance! I've given up a lot to be here. So if you hire me, it'll be the best investment you've ever made. I insure you.